Uh, this is an honor for me. Ladies and gentlemen, this is George Bettinger. I'm the field segment reporter on Memory Lane, and I'm so honored to be sitting here tonight with June Havoc. And gee, if I was Jack Benny at this moment, you know, June, <laughs> I'm so happy, you see, to be here. I knew you'd do that. But I'm wondering why I'm on Channel 13, you know, because I don't know what they're going to pay me. <laughs> Aren't you great? I saw you do uh, uh, Groucho Marx a little while ago. Well, I did a little Groucho Marx. Did you, you know Groucho Marx? Over how did I? Oh, yes. Did you, unfortunately. You know that? Unfortunately. I, I, they always say something like that. Well, was, but Harpo was a very nice man. <laughs> well, I don't know, but you know, Groucho was a very negative human being. Yeah, he was a and somber human being. It's very hard to like him. Yes. You could admire him, but you couldn't really love him. You couldn't get too close to him. That's the truth. But how about somebody like, uh, you were mentioning Bordeville. Now, how about somebody, do, do people today remember someone like Edwin, you know, the perfect oh. fool. He was such a funny man, you know. <laughs> he was so great. It was you one night after another. Well, you are but, you. But, 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 see now, when you play him for kids today, they think about Alice in Wonderland and the Mad Tea Party and the fact that he dubbed in all that great stuff. Which was lucky, because we have a little of him. Uh, right. Not an awful lot, but he was one of the greats, of course. Uh, oh, they all, you know, looking back in the vaudeville uh, thing that we're going to show everybody right. the night before Thanksgiving, you see some of the greatness. It's, of course, very fleeting, simply because there's enough time. That man who created that has enough uh, material to mm -hmm. do 20 shows like that. And I hope that the audience will like it enough to say, hey, let's have some more of that. And you know what the interesting thing that I've learned as a comic, as a performer, is yes. there really is no training ground now for young people to make the mistakes that the Bordillians made so that by the time they made films, they had the act down perfect. Well, there is, in a way. It's just different. The nightclubs are different, you know, because the audiences are drinking and they're on a date and they're worried about if their girlfriend is happy and if this is... People used to go to vaudeville three or four times a week. It was like a natural phenomenon. But you mustn't discount all of the un-nightclub places for young people today. I'm always astonished when they tell me, will you come and see me at so-and-so and so-and-so? Oh, oh, yes. God, like Caroline's, yes, yes. It's what, it isn't even a nightclub. Yes. And you can't eat or drink there. People go there to see the young talent. And I think that's extraordinary. Now, those are all over the country. That's wonderful. And that's a place. And that's something to look forward to. Of course, you can't make a living that way. <laughs> you know, it's an amazing thing, a person like me in a, in a company like this. I understand making a living. I don't make a lot of living, a little bit of living, not too much of living. I could make a living. I'm not so sure. But the whole purpose is that we're here, and we're here to have a good time and tell everyone about a wonderful show that's going to be on Channel 13. Mm -hmm. And Miss Havoc, one more time, please, for us here on WOR Radio, tell us about this special event. Well, I'm, I'm turning into Joe now. Turn us, turn, tell us, please, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, about this special event. <laughs> oh, it's very special indeed. From the moment the gentleman is seen singing with a singing duck, you will be enthralled. <laughs> is it Joe Penner? No, it isn't. It's somebody much less known. I say want to buy a duck, right? Well, this is pre, and the duck sings. And the ducks in. And that's the beginning. And everybody is in this two hours. I mean, you will see people you, you didn't think you'd ever see. Oh, my God. Goodness, look who that is. It's the Duncan sisters. Wow, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Yes, all through the show. And then some people like myself, we, we relate memories of things that happened to us in Vaudeville. I was raised in Vaudeville. Great story. So I just, uh, I just adore this show. And I think everybody ought to tune in 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time, Channel 13. I'll now I know you'll be home for you will of course. Oh. You're gonna have to you're gonna go mad. I will be watching. You will love them all. I will say the magic wide when the duck comes down. Oh, oh you gotta love it. I can't wait to see it. And June, thank you so much. My pleasure. This is George Bettinger on Joe Franklin's memory.